Tuesday, the Capitol has four names were added to the Wisconsin Law Enforcement Memorial. All died in the line of duty, including one man who was serving as a state trooper in Sauk County. Our Kelly Arthur has his story. Four names were added to the Wisconsin Law Enforcement Memorial, including Trooper Anthony Borostowski, who died in the line of duty on the interstate near the Wisconsin Dells. We were doing our pre-deployment medical training, and he was in my class, and I had a huge crush on him. Anna Duncan met Anthony Borostowski while serving in the military together. People always say to me, I see why the two of you guys are together, because you guys are both so weird. <laughs> <laughs> weird or not, the combination worked. We were together for about two and a half years. But on April 11th, Duncan's world was shattered when Borstowski, serving as a state trooper, died in a car accident on patrol. And he never expected anything in return. He just, he just did it because he wanted to. On Friday, people across the state got to learn more about the trooper's service. Anthony J. Borstowski. At the Wisconsin, Wisconsin Law Enforcement Patrol. Memorial, honoring Holy people who died in the line of duty. He was a highly decorated U.S. Army medic who served multiple tours in combat where he saved countless lives. Questions around Borostowski's death in the single vehicle crash remain. A report shows rain and speed surpassing 120 miles per hour were factors, but Duncan says she chooses to honor his life instead of wondering about his death. I may never know what happened, um, but maybe it's just for me not to know. Attorney General Brad Schimmel says there hasn't been an in-the-line-of-duty death since this same ceremony in 2017. He says he hopes he can say the same thing in 2019. In Madison, Keely Arthur, WISC News 3. Three other men were honored today. For more information on all of them, go to our website, channel3000.com.